We'll meet Pastor Yamoran and hear some of the interesting things that he has to say about religion and the world. Also, we're going to meet an African designer who definitely has the world beat culture in mind and a concerned parent who is taking a serious, serious look at the African-American learning experience for young people. All of this and much, much more on the World Beat Music, Art, and Cultural Show. So I would like to take this opportunity to extend my sincere appreciation to all of our customers here in the city of Atlanta, across the state, internationally and nationally for supporting the Curio design since the beginning of the business two years ago. The business is growing strong and we promise you we will be loyal with you and we'll always give you the best we can offer. Greetings. Give thanks and praises to the Almighty. I hope you have enjoyed all the clothes you have just seen. The designer, Bio Suleiman, you can reach him at Curio Designs on 496 Flat Shows Avenue, East Atlanta. My name is Moya Francis. I am a model. I'm 5'8", 120 pounds. I am available for any designer to do a portfolio, fashion shows, etc. Music, Art, and Cultural Show. With me is Omalika Bina. She's the coordinator of the first annual Spring Fun Festival, a benefit for the Harambe Sasa Consciousness Children's Center and African Shule. What does all that mean? <laughs> well, Harambe Sasa Conscious Children's Center and African Shule are two independent African American institutions in Southwest Atlanta. And this is the first annual Spring Fund Festival. We're raising funds for the school. We're looking forward to having a building and more supplies and even a bus soon. So this is our first effort, major effort. A lot of effort had to go into the talent that we're seeing uh, tonight. Yes. Tell me a little bit about how all that came about. Well, I happen to be blessed to have a group of talented friends. And when I thought of the idea of how we could raise money for the school, I just tapped my resources. So I, I work with Barefoot Ballet Children's Dance Ensemble. Uh, the children, as you saw earlier, performed uh, the skit and the play children of the school, current and former students. Uh, Brother Taji and I went to school together. And uh, when Solar was together, I was singing with Solar. There was my mother and Brother Kenneth Zaki and I worked together. So I just happened to be blessed to have talented people who are willing to give up their time and their energies for the benefit of African-American children. How long did it take um, the children of the school to put together the skits? We, I gave them the skits about a month. They've been working on it about a month off and on as they prepare for graduation and just do their regular school um, routine. So they applied themselves diligently for about a week and a half, really. Uh, looking at Solar, it, uh, I, it was reminiscent of my childhood days growing up in Chicago with the Sh Chicago Art Ensemble. Okay. Now, has Solar been together long? Solar um, has been separated for about six years. It came together originally in 1980, originating in New Orleans, Louisiana, and then migrated up to Atlanta and performed here for about five years. And then we separated and came together especially for this evening's event. Oh, well, great. Uh, is, uh, are you going to remain together? We haven't discussed it yet. We have enjoyed being together during our rehearsal time, and it's just been a wonderful energy to share our creative and spiritual energies again. But we're just going to see how things go. We haven't made any definite plans yet. I noticed that this is the first annual yes. spring fun drive. Yes, that means after about a week or two of rest, I'm going to put my thinking cap on and ask permission from the directors to see if we can do something again next year. Will it be similar to this year? Uh, similar and more creativity and just whatever the creator sends forth. 
you know, all we're right. looking forward to combining all kinds of energies to make it a success. If um, people wanted to, uh, if, if, if our viewers are seeing this and they would like for their children to uh, get involved at the, either the Harambe Sasa Consciousness Center or the uh, African uh, Shule, mm -hmm. how would they go about doing that? Okay, well, the address for Harambe Sasa Conscious Children Center is 1240 Kenilworth Drive, Southwest, Atlanta, Georgia, 30310. The phone number is 752-5058. And you can address any inquiries or any calls to that location. All right, thank you for being with us. And this is the World Beat Music, Art, and Cultural Show. And we'll be right back. As we close, a scene from the first annual Fund Festival, which we will be featuring next week. But I'd like to leave you with a few words of wisdom, and they go a little bit like this. You get out of life what you put into it. If you don't put very much in, don't expect to get very much out. I put a whole lot of love into my life every day, and it makes the world a more fun, pleasant place to be. We'll see you next week on the World Beat Music, Art, and Cultural Show.